What is happening, everybody? Back with another wallet review from the Lost Dutchman Leather Company. Today, we have the Finnegan. Now, this Finnegan can be outfitted in multiple colors. The colors that I have here are a navy blue and a light russet brown color for the strap. Now, you'll see that there's a strap that is the closing mechanism for this wall on the outside with the logo of Lost Dutchman Leather proudly embossed on that strap and visible on the outside, which is a nice touch. You also notice this wallet compared to the Franklin that I reviewed is a little bit smaller in size in terms of width. Okay, so you're not gonna be able to put your cash in here like I put my cash in the Franklin. So if you open up the wallet here, you can see my initials are actually engraved on this one. And you can actually not put the cash here because it's too thin. Um, to put cash. So you're going to have to fold cash into threes to get your cash into this wallet. Another thing about this wallet, okay, is there is no quick access slot on the back, just like there was on the Franklin. All right, there's no card access on the slot on the back. But if you're going to see here on the front, you have this little bit of a um, place where you can put some quick access cards due to the cards and the wallet being held together with this strap. So let's take a look at what we can put in this wallet in terms of cards and in terms of uh, cash. So we're gonna get our cards here. And uh, like I had in the last video, I had seven cards that I put into my Franklin wallet. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I have seven cards here now. So these seven cards right here. And I'm gonna open up this wallet here just like this and i'm going to put these cards into that wallet now seven cards are pretty tight they're in there but they're pretty tight so for your cash you would have to put your cash and fold it into three so i just took it out of my franklin wallet which was folded in half you're gonna have to fold it one more time to get it into the franklin here and then just like that excuse me, not the Franklin, into the uh, Finnegan here. And just like that, you can close up shop and you have a nice setup here. Now you'll see there is stitching with this wallet. It is not an origami wallet that folds into place. So you have stitching on both sides here. Now, what I said about a quick access card is you can really, if you want, um, you can, let me just get a card here. You can take a card here. I'm gonna take my health card. You can take a card here and you can slide it right in here. And there you go, you have a quick access card. It's not gonna come out, it's not gonna shake, you know, it's fine. So that is where I put my um, work ID usually, or my driver's license if I need to get a quick access card. I have it right here just to remove and easily put back in, and it stays in place. So this is the Finnegan wallet. Like I said, you can, you can request to have engraving like I have here with the MM. You can request to have the wallet in two-tone, which is the navy blue leather and the russet leather. And the logo of Lost Dutchman Leather cannot be removed. That is actually, actually, you could probably request it. I'm not going to say you can't, but I like the way that looks. So I have seven cards in here with some cash. You can see it's a little bit hard to get out with the cash stuck to the back there. And that is the Finnegan wallet and how it functions. Now, in terms of five stars for this wallet, out of five stars, I would rate this probably uh, three and a half to four. Uh, it is a good looking wallet. It looks very nice in person in hand. It is light. It is smaller than the Franklin wallet. Um, as you can see in the comparison here, it is smaller, but it is a little bit thicker on the side. So um, it doesn't really, you know, since it is stitched here, it doesn't have that origami effect where you can flatten it like that one. So um, I would also recommend this wallet if you're looking to have something just for cards. I wouldn't recommend it for cash because I don't like folding my bills into threes. Um, but it is a nice alternative and I think it looks nicer than the Franklin wallet. So I'll give it a, a slight edge in looks but in functionality terms, I would prefer the Franklin wallet in terms of functionality, even if you carry a little bit of cash and uh, having that quick access slot on the Franklin is a lot better. So 
that's my review of the Finnegan Watt by Lost Dutchman Leather Company. Um, like I said, this channel is going to be reviewing random products. I just happen to have two wallets that I really like that I wanted to review on this channel. And uh, like I stated, I'm going to review some of my vacations that I take with my wife and also my daily activities uh, out here on Long Island. So stay tuned to the next video. Please hit the subscribe button on the bottom. Please like the video. It really helps with the algorithm and helping me grow this channel. As I'm just starting on my YouTube journey, uh, I want to get things a little bit rolling here and, and get some, uh, and get some uh, critiques. If you want to put some critiques in the comment section of what I can do better and what you want to see me review next. So on to the next review. I'll see you next time.